Anyways, so to recap the Leon nerfs, she got a health nerf. Very minor, just lost 50 HP. So if you run the health card now, you have a maximum of 2,350 HP. And I believe by default now, it is... Yeah, 2,100 health. So, yeah, making her a bit squishier. Makes sense, because she's supposed to be a glass cannon. Her damage has also gone down on two different abilities. Her primary fire has gone from 450 to 425, which is still higher than it was before Season 7, so it's still... She's net stronger than she was previously. But the bigger thing, I think, is that Valor got, I think, the first nerf ever in terms of its damage. Correct me if I'm wrong, I don't know... At least in the Those past few years, it has never been nerfed, today, but it finally got a nerf to its damage, going from 400 down to 350. Those That's her auto aim. So, yeah, people are definitely going to be very, very happy about that, just forcing Leon to be even more skillful, and that's exactly what I like. I like the trend towards making her focus more on hitting her shots, and, yeah, being more skillful. Okay, they've got an enemy Leon, so even if I don't do well, this match we're guaranteed to at least have one Leon, hopefully, maybe, possibly do well, unless we're both bad, in which case... Maybe Leon's just bad after these nerfs. It wouldn't make sense. <laughs> I, she's still better than she was in Season 6, and in Season 6, I mean, she wasn't, like, S-tier or anything, but she was okay. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, if both Leon's this match do bad, it's really just an indictment that both of us are trash at the character. But I think we'll be able to do fine here. Hopefully... Now that we're nice and warmed up, having played two terrible 4-0 stomps in a row, uh, we'll, we'll be able to do good this time. This will be this will be the good match. I promise. Yeah, 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 yeah. It'll be great. Assuming everyone loads in, what are we waiting on? I think we're waiting on Ray. One thing uh, I realized about the frames that's super dumb is the loading indicator for the lo the new ranked frames isn't that massive crystal on the top of the frame, which is how no normally frames work, right? They have a crystal crystal lights up, you know they're loaded in. No, it's the numbers on the frame. The Season 6 ranked number is the loading indicator. Not only is that not consistent with the previous frames, but there's a crystal right there. Makes no sense. It's dumb. Alright. Well, third time is the charm. Precision. HP belt. Yes. And uh, they've got Imani. And Vora, which means they have a decent ability split. Except for Leon. This so, will not be an easy fight. Probably just do armor plating. I appreciate some simplicity sometimes, but yeah. I understand people wanting more embellished rank frames. Ooh, wow, Udods is already almost dead. Okay, both teams are playing just in the back. There's Amani and we can burst her out of the sky. So yeah, still very potent burst combos, especially if the enemies don't have DR. Oop, hello. Oop, bad time for me to drop. I'm sorry, Rose Star. No, my pocket. I'm so sorry. Alright, there we go. Yeah, nice burst combos. The burst combos are still very good. But in particular, the Valor burst combo is way worse. Because both Valor and the primary guy got nerfed. So. There's some damage into Inara. Got the precision procs, and she's dead. Good. Hello. She is super low. They're both low back there. Come on, it's on. Let's get him. Nice. I didn't get an assist for either of those, but I set them both up. They were both so low because of my damage. I just got scammed. Actually scammed. Okay, well, there goes Ray. Oh, I kind of wish I had Life Rip. That would be super helpful in a battle versus Inara. Once the DR is down, obviously. Okay, I'll just play it back here. And there we go, we cap. Nice. Oh, you dots, no. You got bursted. Dude, kind of struggling to hit Imani there. Throw that eminence up. It was actually kind of hard to see where the uh, the floor was, because the distortion field was in the way. Just Octavia things. Okay, where's Imani? I heard her. Okay, she's really far away. We have a King ult. Double headshot. Ooh, but I'm one. Okay. Hello, Vora. What are you doing? Oh, you're getting kills. Okay. Ooh, hello. Ah, uh, rooted. Don't like that. 
There we go, pierce through Ray. I don't think she knew I was targeting her, so yeah, we just get that kill. Worth it. Let's get armor plating. I'm gonna stack with arcane warding. I wanna stop that Imani from doing damage. I think I'll only go up to two points in arcane warding, get that 20% damage reduction from Infernal Cannon. Just to be safe, you know? There she is. Yeah, she's doing funny flying stuff on this map. I respect it. But I know to look for it, so it's kind of easy to predict and deal with. Especially with all this burst. By the way, another thing I have to point out uh, is that armor plating is amazing versus Leon, if you didn't know. Because there are some people who don't know. Armor plating counters every single ability that Leon has except her ultimate. Hello. And uh, the reason is because they all actually count as weapon shots. It says so in the description of every ability, fires off a weapon shot. And also, if you just notice, if you go to the shooting range and you shoot someone with your left click, you see that it applies those green vapors. That's cauterize. That only applies on weapon attacks. And if you use Valor, Grace, and Presence, all of those apply the green vapors, and they also work with life rip. So, yeah, buy armor plating versus Leon. Very, very good way to counter her. Just make her useless. Why didn't that hit me? I was clearly in range. Okay, weird. Oh no, she hit hers, but I missed mine. I'm bad, I'm throwing. Hello! Do I miss that? But there we go, we can finish her off thanks to precision. Okay. More stuff up there. Ooh, okay. Oh, hello. That damage reduction is feisty. She's... Uh, gonna make it out of there. Okay. Ooh. Dodged it. Ah. Our healer is down. That is very bad for our chances of winning this push. Oh, and she got behind the wall! No! You didn't say much about the trials, but what do you think about the 500k ammo one? I didn't spot it until the very end of the video. And I made a little edit just to uh, just to show what I think about it. Uh, and by the way, it's absolutely um... here. Let me tie this in with what Jetstream is saying. Jetstream is saying, "What do you think about Overwatch banning people for using the f bomb?" Just to show the freedom that we have in Paladins. I think the new 500k ammo trial is fucking stupid. This is the battleground. No, really, it, it is. The previous trial was too long. It was 150k ammo. 150k, and that was way too long. And so they decided, oh, okay, let's increase it by almost three times. Actually, more than three times. Yeah, no, I, I, that's dumb. I'm not going to spend, like, a hundred hours of my life just shooting ammo with ROM. That's ridiculous. They had better fix that. It's so dumb. Okay, we know where Imani is. Hello. You like death? Come here. There we go. Gotcha. Ah, uh, she's gonna make it out of there. Okay, fair enough. Hello. Ah! No, okay. <laughs> Since you used that audio, did you play Sonic.exe? I actually didn't. I actually was looking up the music from that uh, Mr. Incredible meme. And that was one of the tracks, and I was like, oh, okay, let's use that. Is this gonna make me the on video? <laughs> I might censor it, I don't know. I normally don't like to do that on, like, you know, streams and videos or whatever, because I want to keep my videos accessible for anyone who wants to watch, you know. But, uh, you know, we'll do it for a bit. <laughs> Just for funsies. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Arcane Warding saved my life. Temporarily, anyways. Okay. I miss old trials, they really inspired me to play more champions, and now I just ignore it. Yeah. I feel the same way. The old trials, some of them were ridiculously tough. And bad and unrealistic, right? And some of the others were too easy. But these are just outright boring, because there are no champion-specific trials. And I guess they wanted to make them accessible for every player. Even if you don't own all the champions. But I don't think that's an excuse to omit champion trials entirely. Because, yeah, that was a genuinely good benefit about previous trials, is that they enabled you, or rather forced you, to get out of your comfort zone. Play characters you don't normally like. You know? 
And hey, you know, if you do that enough times, maybe you might find, oh, you actually like this random character's trial force you play. Just as an example. So, yeah. The sparse use of the word makes it all the more impactful when it's used as it should be. Exactly. Oh, there we go. Gotcha. Ooh, an Arzlo. Nice. I completed the last 150k ammo challenge with Vatu. You are insane. Why would you do Why would you do that? That's Are you okay? Do you need a therapist? I hope everything is alright. But I can't believe they would do 500k. Like, that's seriously more than three times the previous trial. And like we did the math on the old trial, and it would take 40 hours of continuous gameplay if you played a normal character who has like six shots. Which is, fun fact, a lot of the characters in this game have like six shots, eight shots, nine shots, you know, once every second. And yeah, it's faster if you play Koga or Rom or Ruckus, but you're still there for hours and hours playing these characters that you don't even necessarily like. And so it's more than triple it. It, it has to be a typo, right? It has to be a typo. There's no way it's not. I think they meant to type in 50k and add in an extra zero. That's the only reason I could think of for an error this egregious. At least I put it at the start, but my goodness. That's so dumb. And it's such a boring trial design, too. I mean, seriously, expend ammo? You don't even have to hit shots? That's the most boring trial idea I think I could come up with. Where are the champion trials? It's so dumb. Five, four, three, okay. two, Let's get more life rip. One. There we go. And let's go up here. Yeah. Gaming. We're losing. Huh. Wait, we're losing? Wait. What is going on right now? Okay, well, there's Imani. Playing a bit more safe. My aim just went to crap. Holy. Okay, well, Ray is one. We're not actually going to finish her, though, because Koga died. Tragically. All right, gotcha. Pop back here. I desperately need a right click. Oh, that's even better, actually. Thank you very much. All right, Vora. You're gone. Let me just put some damage out here. Wow, I'm missing everything. <laughs> Whoops. What is she doing? Did she just crash? That was weird. Anyways, more Valor, and... Oop. Bad time to reload. At least she didn't hit me. I don't think I should really be back here. Like, I'll play in this room, but I don't want to be that far up. Holy crap, can I aim? <laughs> ah! Hand just decided not to work, not to function. Yikes. Oh yeah, she's totally a bot. What happened, man? Huh, okay. Ooh, she is one. I'm not gonna be able to catch her coming back, though. Ooh, boy. Just because. <laughs> there we go, no more Ray. No more Inara. And... Oh, Mani's coming. Somewhere. Hello. Uh, I think she's back. Alright. Bring back play this character for five matches. Yeah, even something as simple as that would still be good, because it would still force people out of their comfort zone. So... They gave me the GM loading frame, but I only reached Masters. Yeah, they said they did that. If you look at the hotfix... They gave the Grandmaster Border to every single person who reached Masters, which really depreciates the value of the Grandmaster Border. But they did it to avoid the problem that that happened last time, which was that they uh, didn't give the Grandmaster Border out to the people who gave Grand who got Grandmaster, and so they had to spend support tickets. It was a whole a whole ordeal. It was really bad. And. I don't really agree with their handling of it this time either, but, I mean, ranked is just a broken system, so... Oh boy, that screen shake. I get that it's supposed to feel impactful, and I'm happy with the screen shake for the enemies, but why does it give screen shake for the teammates? That ultimate. Like, that's just sabotage. <laughs> okay. 
Uh, eminence. Wow. Do not like doing 600 damage there. Oh, and I... Oh, I missed that shot. She was so warm. Oh, yeah. I do not like... I do not like that screen shake. I can't believe she lived that. That armor plating plus the nerfs is just like, oof. Oh, hello, Leon. This angle is so awkward to play Leon at on this map. Like, I guess I have to push my way around here, but... That's awkward, too. Especially with my 50% accuracy right now. They should make a title called The Wall Buster. For people who have really bad accuracy and just do a bunch of damage to the wall. <laughs> Drawing an outline around the characters. On the wall. Didn't think Leon needed nerfs, to be honest. Honestly, I would have just nerfed the health. I was kind of fine with where she was previously, because armor plating really counters her. And... I like the idea of buffing up more damage champions and, like, trending towards that. Like they did with Leon and Willow. You know, doing that to other damage champions who are not as good, you know? But, uh, yeah, they've gone this route instead. And you know what? I guess that's fair enough as well. A lot of the community really didn't like Leon being as strong as she was. And so, yeah. This is a way to keep her in check. And she was very strong, there's no doubt about that. Alright, just land those headshots. There we go. Ooh, that's rough. You know, I would have had that kill, but I'm trash at the game. <laughs> ah! Crap. I'm bad. Oh no, Koga. We got the ray, that's gonna be huge, but Azan's about to die to Vora. Maybe? Or not? Okay, no Armageddon? Well, uh... Great, anyways. Hello. Oh, she actually got Octavia, that's so bad. Alright, chill back here. Get some lifesteal going out. Oh, she's so low. And dodge that. Overtime! She is so, so low, but she's running away. I can't find her. Oh, there she is. Oh, that missed. She fell behind the wall. I think we actually lose this game here. Oh, I dashed on the point, but that was too slow. Okay. Well, that's a shame. It looks like their Leon was better than me after all. <laughs> like I said, I, uh, I haven't played much Leon recently. So, yeah. I'm a bit rusty. I still got 20 kills, which isn't bad. But I definitely should have done better that game. I just... I, I, I haven't played much Leon. That's all I'm going to chalk it up to. <laughs> also, Rostar, I thought you said you were going to pocket me with bullets. Rostar. <laughs> Aw. Well, there's the Leon nerfs for you. Let's go ahead and cue now. Okay.